Hello, welcome to one and all to Trinity English Day Four. Today we are going to discuss about grammar and basically what is grammar, what is the purpose of grammar, what is the importance of grammar, and so on. So why late? Let's get into the subject. Basically, grammar is the backbone of the language. To any language, if it is supposed to exist, grammar is the most important thing that we have to know. And here, grammar is the glamour of the language. As glamour gives beauty to the face, glamour gives beauty to the person. In the same way, grammar gives beauty to the language. So, grammar is the glamour of the language. We should develop our grammatical skills in a proper way so that we can speak the language accurately. And here, the word grammar originated from ancient Greek. And here, it is the word called grammatike. And the meaning is art of letters. And here, it has originated long ago and it has continued for ages together. If you come to the case of India, basically in India, the word grammar first originated in Sanskrit, that is in Iron Age, and the person who has brought to the people was Yeska in the 6th century BC. And thereafter, the grammar of the 4th century, the grammar of the 3rd century, and uh, so on, continues the grammatical history of India. And here, the first grammar book, which is known as Pamphlet for Grammar, was written by William Balloka in the year 1586. And here, now we are going to discuss about the importance of grammar. Why grammar is important? Most of the people feel grammar the difficult part. And here, we are going to discuss about why grammar is more important in our day-to-day -day life. First, grammar is behind the logic of the language. If we are supposed to speak logically, accurately exactly the language we should know grammar very well and the second one it provides a deep understanding or an insight into the language and here we also understand the structure of the language for example if you take a structure subject verb object is a structure i teach english this is a structure and basing upon this structure I can make a number of sentences and I can speak and I can use the language wherever it is possible and if you take so many structures in the language we can construct the language very easily without any problem if we do not know grammar then we struggle as we do not know the structures and further Grammar to speak clearly and effectively. If we know grammar, we can speak clearly without any problem, without any fear. And we can speak effectively. We can communicate effectively without any problem. Most of the times, so many people, when they are supposed to speak in public, they fear not because they are not well versed with their knowledge, but it is because they are not effective at the language. And further going, if you want to communicate in an artful way, we need to know grammar. Grammar is artful because it is structured in a proper way. So, these are the different importance of the grammar. And now, what is the purpose of grammar? And here, words are the building blocks of the language. The entire grammar is built with words. And 
here, since it is built with words, they are the building blocks. How the blocks are required to build a building in the same way, the words are the building blocks for the language. And here, a set of rules are there in order to determine how these building blocks can be put together in different combinations. As I told you, the structures, there are different structures and these words, the combination of maybe noun, verb and another noun, so on and so forth. So here, basically, these building blocks, how they are put together in different combinations such as phrases, clauses and uh, sentences. We have phrases, clauses, sentences, so many other combinations. And these combinations, when we put all those things together, when we put all these combinations together, we enrich the conversation. If we want to enrich our conversation, we should be good at grammar. We should be able to effectively practice grammar. So, at the end, I would like to say any person who learns grammar effectively can communicate effectively and prosper his language in a proper way. Thank you, one and all. Thank you for being with me. If you please like the content, subscribe, like, share and put me in the comments. Your comments are very valuable to me. Thank you, one and all.